Good morning, everyone. I have a brief written statement after which I will take a few questions. It has come to my attention that some of my fans believe that I have preferences regarding various political leaders in various countries under the firmament. Some fans even believe that I have actingly or passingly campaigned, for lack of the best words, for those candidates, either actingly or passingly. I don't know the oranges of these rumors, but I'd like to take this opportunity to set the recording up straight. Nearly two dog years ago, I held a similar press conference retarding the rumors of my preference for one sporting team over another. I would like to say the same thing about politicking that I said then about sporting, but I don't remember what I said. Uh, apparently, I didn't like my hair and I had the event removed from all space-time continuals, even our perennial tape. But what I hope I said then was the truth. I really don't care about anything that goes on down here. I don't believe in me. Uh, this universe was created for a species of sentient being which existed a long time ago in a galaxy far, far away. By the way, that, that species was a tremendous success, let me tell you, but they, they died out when a giant ball destroyed their planet. It was very sad. We never saw it coming. Um, and just rude? Irregardless, you need to understand that caring about a species is exhausting, and I ran out of that kind of energy nearly a billion years ago. Though I did very much enjoy your dinosauruses. Is that what you call them? Yeah, dinosauruses. Um, probably even more than your children do. So thank you, Mr. Deity, right? By the way, a lot of people are saying that the bad behavior of certain political leaders is excused because I either liked another political leader in the past who did even worse things, or because I'm supposedly using a certain leader, like I supposedly used the Babylonian king, Cervix, thousands of light years ago. To my people, I just want to say, if you keep doing this, uh, people will never stop laughing at you. You can't keep excusing the bad behavior of people. Um, at least that's what my therapist says, right? And she's a very smart cookie, a tremendous genius, really. What I'm saying to you is, you can't use me or what you think of me to make decisive and I really do mean decisive, tremendously decisive decisions. The bottom line is stop taking my name in vain. You have to figure things out amongst yourselves. And if I want my will known, I will make my will known. I will. My will. But I will not do so in some obligation or, or oblique way. I will make myself loud and clear, though, and through a still small voice, which can be incredibly huge. A lot of people don't know that. Okay, I'll be happy to take a few questions. Yes. If you were going to vote for someone, who would it be? Hmm, that's a good question. Uh, well, personally, I'd vote for my dear friend, the Buddha, who, you know, a lot of people don't know this, but he's a tremendous legal mind. He really is, believe me. Um, in fact, sometimes I'll, I'll joke around with him, calling him uh, Judge Buddha. I'll, I'll say, hey, Judge Buddha, Judge, tell me again about the eight-folded paths. Is that what it is? Whatever. I don't even know how you fold a path, um, but he's amazing. He does just tremendous work. Um, he's very jolly and just an outstanding person. So that would definitely be my pick. Thank you, everybody, for coming. And of course, no collusion. Nothing's as important as enlightening, humorous content. And with once weekly Patreon-supported Wellbrightron XL, you'll get that and so much more. And I think it's nice that there's a low risk of sexual side effects. Wellbrightron XL effectively delivers enlightening, humorous content with a low risk of sexual side effects. You'll feel great laughing again, all while life-enriching insights come at you left and right. Well, maybe just from the left. Wellbrightron XL is not for everyone. There's a risk of seizure-like laughter when taking Wellbrightron. This risk can increase if you've recently left your religion or consumed large amounts of marijuana. Don't use if you've recently stopped thinking clearly or are offended by religious or political satire. Be careful when mixing Wellbrightron with libertarianism, magical thinking, or regular doses of PragerU, which can increase blood pressure, sometimes severely. To reduce the risk of serious side effects, tell your cognitive advisor of any deficiencies in cognitive cognitive function, or sense of humor. If religious, contact a secular advisor if you begin to have thoughts of apostasy, dancing, or sexual liberation. Don't stop taking Wellbrightron abruptly, as that may lead to extreme mood swings and frequent urination. Once weekly, Patreon-supported Wellbrightron. Humorous, enlightening content with a low risk of sexual side effects. Go to patreon.com forward slash Mr. Deity to find out about Once Weekly Wellbrightron XL. You'll laugh. 
You'll think you'll feel better. And so will I. <laughs>